This is my third Prometheus. Last weekend I was out at uh, out at the fairgrounds flying my Prometheus. I don't know if I lost a servo or lost orientation, but it I think it, the servo was going bad. The puzzling thing about it is when I got it back to the bench, everything worked, and that was weird. But I was fighting it for control, and it ended up going down in the woods. Fell to the ground. Fortunately, it wasn't stuck in a tree, but it was destroyed. Wasn't filming at the time, so I found one in Texas. Pretty much ordered it the same day from the guy. Got it yesterday and put it together. So this is the flight of my brand new, Pro well, new to me anyway, Prometheus. It, it seems like it doesn't have very many flights on it. It's in pretty good shape. So here we go with the replacement Prometheus, number three. Oh yeah. Yeah, baby. That's the way Prometheus is supposed to fly. Oh yeah. Inverted all day long, baby. This one doesn't give me any problems so far. I like it. I wish they had not discontinued these things. It's such a good flying plane. Just does absolutely anything you want it to do.
So smooth. Love it. Only got a 4,000 pack in it, so I'll probably just keep the flight to five minutes. Then see what my usage is. Probably the same as my other one. Try a little inverted Harrier action. Always do that with plenty of altitude. Oop, too much throttle. Too much throttle. Turned it into a flat spin. <laughs> Boy, this plane is fun. Good grief. Alright, so that's five minutes. I'll go ahead and land her. Got a good strip wind, but it's not very much of a wind, so she'll probably land a little fast. Oh, beautiful. Oh, I like it. Oh, I like it. <laughs> Whoever had it before must have pancaked the landing. Because his gear, his gear squashed out like tired goose feet. Check them out. Look at that. But, it's a good wide stance though. Nice and stable. And other than bent gear, the plane is pristine, in pristine condition, so I can't complain. I have another Prometheus to fly. Thanks for watching.